I'm still walking in the wilderness. What the hell? I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> Back in civilization again. We are out of the 100 mile wilderness. All the coffee. All the All the coffee. It's 20 feet. Yeah. From the tea, it just falls after yeah. the whoosh. You're not supposed to go after them. Oh, you I didn't know. Going that. Well, I mean, my ball, like you said, I, it just fell over from the wind. Hikers all riding out for the 100 mile wilderness. Good luck, guys. You guys are going to love it. Yeah. Hikers waiting, doing their thing. Hikers eat. Oh, you're doing their thing. Yeah, yeah. Shaw's following. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Hey, good luck, Chad. It's good running into you again. All you guys, good luck. And now Nemo has sort of crowded up everything. Nice. My man, Chad. I started with Chad on day one. He's the very first person I met. And now he's about to enter the 100 mile wilderness and go up to Katahdin. Old man says the block. Yeah. Today, me and Patience are parting ways. Oh. my hair okay? You're good. You're good. Such a sad day. Does my hair look good? First time I've heard a hiker say that. We've been hiking for about a month and a half, maybe. I don't know. But it's the longest I've traveled with anybody or hiked with anybody. And in just a few moments, gotta say bye. Bye. So, back in the woods now, being classic rock. Minus patience, which I'll get to in a minute. Um, we uh, just coming back from Shaw's, had a great stay, one of my favorite hostels by far. And you know, uh, what's been great about my flip flop experience so far is running into people that I've met from the beginning, um, and people I've met just along the trail that you know were just doing it, and uh. You know, it's been great. Great seeing them. I've met, seen a lot of people in the 100 mile wilderness that I knew, you know, and uh, over at Shaw's, I ran into my man Chad, which some of you might remember from the beginning, first couple videos. But uh, he ended up getting the name Pathfinder, and I met him or seen him at Shaw's, <clears throat> and we hung out. And uh, yesterday he left and entered the 100 mile wilderness. So good luck, buddy. Good luck, old Pathfinder, and congrats. Also, uh, it, I mean, it was great. Hung out with the uh, Minnesota Hikings. They're a guys, group of guys from Minnesota that hike together. Really, really cool group. I've met them a little bit along the trail and, uh, you know, glad to. Uh, I was really glad to be at Shaw's when and uh, seeing these people get pumped up about the 100 mile wilderness and everything. It was really great. But also at the same time, it is where Patience got off the trail. Um, she has some stuff going on back home, you know, and uh, the good news is the trail isn't going anywhere. We, uh, we knew this was coming and but, you know, I just want to say it's been great, you know, hiking with you, Patience, and having you as a partner. Um, I had a lot of good times, you know, and uh, I'm glad we got the summit together and glad we got to hike together for the, it was either a month and a half, maybe closer to two months. So you were a big part of my hike and thank you, you know, if you see this. But anyways, right now, me and Classic Rock decided to stick together and uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We're going to take an easy day today. 
don't want to go too hard in the paint but yeah feels good to be back but you guys have a good one and uh talk at you later So, this morning, or last night, I started out leaning against that wall. Now I'm here. Yesterday was the first day of hiking without patience. It was a little difficult, you know, or a little weird, I would say. A little, I wouldn't say difficult, but it was a little weird, you know. You hike with somebody for eight it could even be a week, but, you know, we hiked together for almost two months, and, you know, you form a bond, friendship, and, you know, now she's going home, and it's okay, you know, these things happen. I look at it as, like, when I was in the military, and people would uh, get stationed in other places, you know. Which I still keep in contact with them. Um, you know, I still keep in contact with her. But it's a little, you know, this has been the first time since I've been on trail that I was able to sleep in a shelter by myself without anybody there. So, good stuff. All right, all right. Look who I just ran into, my good friend Phoenix. Um, celebrating Canada Canada Day will never be the same again. Yeah. <laughs> oh Canada. Oh Canada. Just a little view from where I'll be sleeping tonight. Oh yeah. This is nice. Look at the a little bit of red on those trees over there. This is the stuff I like seeing. All that over there. Ooh, look at that. All right, all right. Moxie Pond. Something like that. Correction from earlier. This is Bald Mountain Pond. But this is nice. Just laying up in my hammock. Enjoying the view. Maine's a beautiful place. That's for sure. <laughs> 